Here's how to make a bibliography entry in Noodle Tools. First of all, I have my source open, and if I look it over, I can see that the title of the article is Long Live the Web. The author is Tim Lee Berners. The source is Scientific American, a magazine, and the date of publication is December 2010. It's volume three, 303, issue 6, and pages 80 to 85. If I scroll down, I can see that the database used for this article was Science Reference Center. So now that I have all the information about my source that I need, I can go to Noodle Tools and I'll go to my project and I'll open my bibliography. And I will select which type of citation it is. It's a magazine. Create citation. And then I have to answer some more questions. Where can other people find this source? Well, I don't think they can find it in print. Um, I certainly didn't, so I'm going to choose online. And I think if you find an article online, that's what you should choose as well. Let me go to the next screen. And it asks, was this work originally in print? Yes, it was. And so I just go next. And now I'm ready to open where I'm ready to fill out the form for my citation. The author's name, Tim Lee Berners. The article title was Long Live the Web. And note down here that it says to capitalize the first letter of important words in the title. The name of the magazine, Scientific American. And the date of publication was December 2010. And the page numbers, 80 to 85. And the name of the database was Science Reference Center. And there we go. And now it asks for a URL. And if you put the URL in there, it's a good idea because you will have a link to it then anytime you open Noodle Tools. You'll have a link to the article. So I'm going to copy it and then paste it. The date I viewed it automatically is populated there, so I'm ready to generate my citation. And there it is. And now I'm ready to do my next one after I open, after I find the next one, I just get right started from the same place.